The crime begins with a bang. Thankfully, this explosion was a controlled demonstration for Urzgan judges to show them the signs and effects of different IED blasts. This one is uh, not as deep. It's part of an ongoing coalition effort to educate legal officials on the investigation and apprehension of IED building insurgents. Through a combination of hands-on and classroom lessons, the judges learned valuable information about gathering forensic evidence vital to convicting criminals. They saw how they gather the evidence and so far that's what they went through. It's much better than reading through a manual or a book. Coalition instructors also gave local prosecutors, police and criminal investigators instruction on identifying IED components, their trigger systems and how to collect fingerprints. He's guilty. Instructors hope the Afghans use these new skills in their pursuit of IED-related crime. We hope to see that replicated in the courtrooms in terms of better evidence prosecution packs and better admissible evidence in the courts. Armed with this new knowledge, Urzgan legal officials will return to their districts better prepared to apprehend and prosecute IED-building criminals, protecting their communities and the future of Afghanistan. Army Sergeant Brian Spradlin, multinational base Terran Cot, Afghanistan. <laughs>